In today's world, it's easy to get bogged down by all the negativity and challenges we face. But I want to remind you there's always a reason to be positive and hopeful. We encourage everyone to practice kindness and empathy towards one another both in and out of school. We're all going through our own struggles and challenges, but a little bit of kindness can go a long way. And I finally want to remind everyone you are capable of achieving your goals no matter how big or small they may seem. With hard work, determination, and a positive attitude, anything is possible. Hey, hey, hey there, Bulldogs. I'm Braden, and today you will know some random facts. Did you know that all electricity powering the internet weighs the exact same as an apricot? Now that a hippo's jaw opens wide enough to fit a sports car inside? Also, that will take 19 minutes to fall from the North Pole to Earth's core. And that sixth generation back, you have 64 great great grandparents. So weird. That's all for this week, Bulldogs. I will see you next time for another brain break. What's good, athletes? Immediately after spring break will be your session for sports, consisting of wrestling, track, and girls basketball. Make sure during spring break to have final forms and physicals ready if you are interested. Enjoy your spring break, and I'll see you guys later. What's good, Bulldogs? It's Evan back with your sports recap. Congrats to our Lady Bulldogs for finishing off the regular season with an undefeated record of 9-0. Not only did they have a perfect season, but they also won their first playoff game last week against Hilltop Heritage. Good job, Bulldogs. Our football team won against Gia Joni and beat them in the quarterfinals just to come up short the next week against Hilltop. It's okay, Bulldogs, just make sure to keep your heads up. And great job to Xavier Reinhout for coming out on top and taking first place for the sixth graders. That's it for me, Bulldogs. Hey, Baker, it's my Asia. What's your college special reminder? Instead of wearing your average Baker uniform, why don't you mix it up on Wednesdays and wear some college gear for maybe a college you want to go to or a family member's old college shirt. It's a heavenly day for a divine tip. It's Kevin again with your tip from the godlike Miss Miller. Hi, this is Mrs. Miller with your success tip for the week. My success tip for all Baker students is to adopt a growth mindset, knowing that every single mistake that you make, both in your academics and in personal life, helps you to grow. Your brain builds new connections and allows you to learn from those mistakes and do better next time. Even as adults, as teachers, we make mistakes, and it's always an opportunity for us to learn and grow. And remember that your education is a journey, not a destination, that every single mistake you make gets you to the point where you need to be. That's my success tip for the week. And again, thank you, Ms. Miller, for the divine tip. Hey, it's Mrs. Oval, and I just wanted to give a big shout out to Vance Band for the performance on March 7th at Meeker Middle School for Middle School Band Fest. Despite all the ups and downs they have had this year and having to navigate more difficult music, they received an excellent rating for the performance. They did amazing and I could not be more proud of their accomplishment. If you see a student that is in a band's band, give them another shout out and tell them how amazing they were because they deserve it after all of their hard work. As a Baker student in the sixth or seventh grade, you may be searching for an elective for the next year, but it's having a hard time. Photography may be the subject for you. This class is taught by Ms. Barkley in room 2312. What opportunities may this offer though? Let's see. As a photography student, I have learned how to be more confident while I speak and give directions. Photography has taught me how to improve my soft skills, such as communication, problem solving, and quick thinking. I feel myself becoming more confident and quick on my feet while in a professional setting. One of these soft skills is professional communication. That can be applied in and outside of class. As a Baker family, we strive to make professional emails and in-person conversations. That can be with classmates, colleagues, and even with staff members. You can apply this skill to many careers and even in daily life. For instance, a CEO, customer services, and other important careers. If you are in 6th to 7th grade and are looking at electives next year, please consider photography. Photography helps you learn how to use DSLR cameras, 
Adobe Lightroom, and Photoshop. After learning how to use cameras, you get to do a lot of fun projects where professional soft skills, technical skills, and your software editing skills are put to the test. We never do it. Blooper. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. How's everything going, Clyde? Um. <laughs> Oh. You're right, bud. It's okay. It's okay. Well, it's okay. Wait, I don't know what you can do. What? No pressure. No pressure. Yeah, no pressure. No pressure. No pressure. Just bloopers. Yeah, just bloopers. Just bloopers. Right, Evelyn? Bloopers. <laughs> Viola Davis. Michelle Obama. My sister. He's probably Miss Prieto. My uh, mom. Probably Miss Fonts. She's a nice actor. Because she's just been there for me. She is incredibly smart because she's always telling us to do like our hard work. Because uh, honestly, I wouldn't be here without her. Because like, I think me and her are very close to each other. And when she acts, the person she's acting, you, you really think it's is that person. My whole life, she basically kind of raised me. She was a lawyer, a mother, ran the house, and like, she's always there for us, and like, she never, she doesn't give up on us. Are you recording? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I got that on her. Is your acting that good? Her acting's that good. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Hey Bulldogs, it's Edwin once again. Next week is spring break. Make sure you get your homework and missing work in so you can relax and not worry about your grade dropping. Stay positive, stay kind, and remember Bulldogs, we're always on time, on track, and on a mission to academic excellence.